halftime update. SDSU is up 10 to 7. Right before the half, Fresno State blocked a field goal from San Diego State. Really disappointing. They froze the kicker. They got called two timeouts right before that kick, and then they blocked it. So that was really crazy. But the game started out uh, pretty even. Uh, Fresno State uh, running back Ronnie Rivers punched it in from about like three yards out, and then San Diego State came back, and they had a touchdown from a uh, Chase Jasmine from about like five yards out. San Diego State had uh, two interceptions, one from Luke Barku, and he's uh, one of the leaders in the nation for interceptions this year. So good job on him and then uh, Fresno State they answered back with an interception of their own uh, both teams couldn't really do much with the uh, turnovers but then uh, San Diego State they got a, a late field goal it was about 17 yards after a very good drive and that is the difference in the game right now so San Diego State is barely hanging on to a lead 10 to 7 it should be a very interesting second half it could be anybody's game, so it should be an exciting finish here at SDCCU Stadium. I'll give you more updates throughout the game.
and that is a final. SDSU wins the battle for the old oil can trophy, 17 to seven. Chase Jasmine caught a three yard touchdown pass from Ryan Agnew with uh, 13 minutes and 14 seconds into the fourth quarter. Fresno State was driving, trying to make it very interesting, trying to pull within one score, but then Luke Barku got his second interception of the day on like the three yard line to really just seal it and really just dash the hopes of the Fresno State Bulldogs. San Diego State reclaims the battle for the old oil can trophy. What a fantastic game. I'm so glad that I picked the right team <laughs> and that the home team San Diego State won. My next game is kind of up in the air. I was planning on going to Stanford to check out um, Stanford playing Notre Dame. Now I'm not too sure. I have uh, some scheduling conflicts. I might be uh, seeing UCLA play Cal. Um, I'm still deciding what I'm going to do that weekend, but please stay in touch to my Instagram page at Gianni Football and my YouTube page Gianni Football for further updates. But wow, what a game! I'm so glad I can attend such an awesome game, a California rivalry at its best. Until next time, peace out.